If you could have any drink on tap in your house, what would it be? <laughs> that's a, wow, man, that's a good question. Do you have an answer to this? Well, here's what I here, I'll tell you guys what I drink. Okay, this is literally what I I, I drink: water, um, chamomile tea, uh, a lot of chamomile tea. I drink I drink at least two or three cups of chamomile tea every day because <laughs> I'm I'm like an 85 year old man. Uh, <laughs> And, and, uh, it just, it's, it's very calming, right? It's just, a, it doesn't put me to sleep like it does to other people. And it's just a very like calming, relaxing. I like to get a nice tea before I do shows because it calms me down a little bit. I like to get a chamomile tea before I, you know, dig into my, my spreadsheets and be okay. a nerd. Uh, so ca- I, I drink chamomile tea and I also have been drinking more Gatorade zero. Yes. God, I love Gatorade zero. It's really good. I it's do. like, I, like, especially you, especially you cannot drink it not cold. It has I, to be cold. It has to be real cold. Yes. Honestly. And, yeah. And, and yeah, so it's like, it's like diet Gatorade basically. Uh, yeah. and, and yeah, so actually I'm, I'm not kidding. Like a week ago, less than a week ago, I bought a hundred little packets of, of Gatorade zero. Oh, you did. You do, so you do the packets and then you pour them in. So yeah. That, your, okay. Right, because I was trying not to go broke on Gatorade. Yeah, no, no, it's fair. I, I've I haven't gotten to the point of like Costcoing, you know, the, the the or Amazoning this new upset. Like it's this is it's probably a two month old thing for me with Gatorade yeah. Zero. Like a refreshing, maybe once a week kind of like watch, like drink it while I'm watching football on a Sunday, or like if once I had a, a lo- really? long run or something like that, and then I go that route. Yeah. Oh, but in the summer, I was drinking like three a day. Yeah, I'm 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 gonna be there is what I'm saying. I'm okay, very okay. I'm I'm inching closer to more and more Gatorade Zero. But I think that the, the blue one that they have, uh, I can't remember the exact because fl- they have the stupid flavor names. Uh, Gatorade oh, does. Yeah, I forget what is it called. Ice iceberg a melt melting ice cap. Yeah, it's not it's not the pure blue one, but it's the one that's like a little bit faded blue, right? It's like yeah, diluted it with something. Uh, that's my fave. That would be on tap for me. I don't drink enough alcohol to put alcohol on tap. It just it just wouldn't be worth it for me. Yeah, I mean, I, I was thinking the same. For me, it would be, it would be lime polar seltzer. Mm. I think would would mm. be on, would be on tap. Uh, if I had to choose an alcohol, oh, I know what it would be. Man, this is low T as hell, but I'll say it anyway. It would be grapefruit, white claw. Great, you're a grapefruit guy with white I'm claw. A, Wait, are you not? I, grapefruit's not that good. No? What do you No, mean? I'd probably say my favorite white claw is lime. Oh, and then, yeah, I do. I love lime. I do love it. And then, because it's, uh, wh- some of the white claws, though, like, I I do like the watermelon white claw, but you can't have more than two of them because it just gets too sweet and too much. Like, that's why the lime one is just very refreshing, and it's just, okay. you could you could drink a lot of it. I I tend to love the grapefruit. Why do I love the grapefruit so much? I don't even like grapefruit. Speaking of eighty-five-year-old men, good. Lord. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Uh, ch- yeah. And check this out. This is, I got this the other day. Uh, polar grapefruit. So. Oh, there you go. So okay. So you're a big grapefruit guy. Apparently, I think grapefruit's one of those flavors that you like more and more as you age. And since you're old, uh, <laughs> that's why you like grapefruit. Yeah. If I had a tap of that, whoo boy, I would drink two and a half of those in a hurry. Let me tell you. Yeah. We we had the lamest answers for that question. I mean, wait, what, what do people want? Like, like a, a triple IPA. Like, it, like I, I want it to come out as sludge. Yeah. I mean, like, if I were being, if I, like, like, if I could handle it, I would love, like, a chocolate milk tap. But right. my, my body would die. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't. I couldn't have chocolate milk all the time. You kidding me? <laughs> oh, my God. It really would. You would, you would, you would cease to be. It would be the worst thing imaginable for for my body. Would be chocolate milk. Oh man! Be doing oh, that. Speaking of this, I I heard I was watching the Dolphins game on Sunday, and they said, "Oh, you know, Raheem Mostert struggles to keep up his weight. He has to eat like multiple high calorie protein bars every day to keep up his weight." And I was like, "Man, f you, dude!" Like, yeah. I'm like a I'm a 40 year old dad, like watching every single thing i i eat like right. if i eat like one piece of pizza like it's over like, it's, yeah that's like three pounds instantly yeah and, back in your back in your 20s anyone listening to this who has not reached their 30s in your 20s you could get away with out exercising a bad diet yeah. right 
Yeah. You can't do that anymore. Like no. you, you, you can exercise, but you will still gain weight if you have a bad diet. It, it doesn't matter. Like it, it doesn't, doesn't matter how, how hard you actually, I've tried, I've tried running more, biking more, doing all this stuff. It doesn't matter. Like if you eat the pizza, it's Jover for you. Yeah. Yeah. My, my philosophy, you know, over a lot, I don't know if you heard, but I, I am a gluten, dairy, and soy free. <laughs> my philosophy with, uh, obviously eating well is good, right. Is good for you. But if you are trying to like keep a figure or something, that's like, you're going to do that in the kitchen. And if you're going to exercise, you're doing that more for your body's like longevity and being and being able to function and, and do well. It's not really like a you're going to necessarily get super, super, super lean by only exercising. You need right. that kitchen component with it. I mean, look, uh, I, I'm eating carrots with my hummus lately. I mean, it's it's Ooh. it's awful. My, my goal is really, JJ, never to eat anything that tastes good. And I think that it, that's you can't go wrong with that. Yeah.